All right, welcome everybody. It's KB here. And uh, you know, the most popular web browser is the Google Chrome because it works, because it's good, because many people use it, because they have the most popular websites like YouTube, Google.com, so they can promote their own browser. Overall, you can say that Google Chrome is like really good browser. But some people don't like Google Chrome because they don't want to get tracked by Google. Uh, all the privacy thingies, okay, they want to uh, feel more secure, okay, so they use different browser. So this video is for those people. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you guys uh, this thing called ungoogled Chromium. You know, almost every modern browser now these days is based on Chromium, open source project. Uh, I don't need to explain you guys what Chromium is. Okay, so it's a open source project that anyone can use and build their own browser even the microsoft edge browser is based on chromium so you can say basically the microsoft edge browser is also a chrome browser because it is based on the same engine as the chrome same project as the chrome uh, chromium okay so same thing goes for the another popular web browser called brave which is also used by many people is also a chrome because it is based on chromium so yeah <laughs> so in this video i'm just going to talk about this this is for those people who want to have a secure browser which has nothing to do with any company okay uh, basically this is a ungoogled chromium there is no google components or anything like that this browser is clean okay so i will put link in the description for this github page from here you can download and learn more about this uh, ungoogled chromium web browser if you visit this uh, page at github you will know everything you need to know about this ungoogled chromium okay so yeah just go here and uh, go to download binaries when you need to download it okay uh, actually i will put link in the description for the uh, this direct link to from here you can download the ungoogled chromium and it is available for everything actually linux mac or windows just it works everywhere okay this is a cool project okay and uh, let me show you what it is okay i'm gonna try my best to explain you guys what it is this web browser is privacy focused browser an open source project just like a chromium and uh, the only difference between this and uh, the Google Chrome is that it doesn't have any components of Google. It doesn't have anything related to Google. You are not being tracked or anything like that. If that's what you're scared of, okay. I'm not gonna say that I, I use this browser on daily basis because I, I want the privacy and everything. No, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. <laughs> Look at my taskbar. I have three Google Chromes at the bottom because uh, I use Google services a lot. I make videos and everything. So, you know, uh, you know what's up. Okay. So this is only for those people who just want the privacy browser plus the browser as good as Google Chrome. So I think there is nothing better than ungoogled Chromium because uh, it's basically a Google Chrome, but without any Google services. Okay, let me go to the settings actually. Okay, and there is this section, you and Google. Now, if you go to the Google Chrome, you can sign in here, you can sync all the settings, all your browsing history and everything. Uh, you can't do that. You can't do that. There is no option, okay. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's like that. Yeah, it looks like a Google Chrome, but it has nothing related to Google. Okay, there is nothing. Even the, uh, you know, default search engine is turned off. If I try to search anything, you you can't search it. Okay, you need to enter the address like google.com. Yeah, there you go. And from here, you know, it's not like you can't browse the google.com. 
you can okay but another thing that even if you go to the web store uh, if I can go to the web store actually yeah, by shortcut you can't go to go to the web store you know where you can download the Chrome extensions go in there select any extension you can't install it yeah <laughs> it's it's like that you know there is some benefits of having uh, this uh, on Google Chromium is that it's gonna be more secure and uh, your privacy will be protected I guess uh, but you can't do few stuffs it's gonna be fast it's gonna be as good as Google Chrome in everything browsing and everything but uh, for example you see here you can't install extensions or anything like that you can enable them I'm sure there is a way to enable uh, the extension thingy uh, because it is blocked you can play with the uh, chrome flags i think and you can enable the extension installation but if you want the pure <laughs> privacy stuff uh, i think leave it as it is and you're gonna be good okay so i'm not gonna talk too much as i said guys i don't use any other browser than google chrome i do use microsoft edge which i really like actually for the most stuff and it is as good as the google chrome so yeah i use two browsers the google chrome and the microsoft edge browser it comes with windows 10 and 11 it's it's here so i just use it a little bit <laughs> and uh, yeah if you are one of those people who want the privacy browser i think this one is good and i know some people in the comments are gonna say KB, why don't you use, uh, what was the name, uh, Brave Browser, it's very good. You know, I, I get it. I mean, I don't want to say anything about it, but the Brave Browser ha also has its own way of doing things, okay? <laughs> okay, I, okay, I don't want to get into it, but, you know, uh, I don't use the Brave Browser. Uh, if I needed to, I would, but you know, I use most of the Google services a lot. So it's best for me to use just Google uh, Chrome so I can sync my settings, sync my everything, history and everything. Okay. It just works well with the Google accounts. So that's why I just use the Google Chrome. So yeah, uh, another bad thing about this browser is that you can't sync settings you can't log into uh, the google account because there is no google services or anything like that in, inside this browser if you uninstall this browser and uh, reinstall it you're gonna lose everything what you have done on the website or if you have saved any password or anything like that so yeah that's a bad thing i guess but if you just want to have a browser which has nothing to do with any company and you just want the clean privacy focused browser uh, i think this one is good yeah <laughs> i mean you your isp can still track you because uh, they know what website you visit you know there are many things that can be said about privacy so i'm not gonna go deep but uh, yeah this browser is also really good if you're looking for something other than google chrome uh, but you want the uh, browser as good as google chrome so this is the one you need yeah that's it i talk too much i know that i know that yay <laughs> so i will put link in the description for the ungoogled chromium it's a open source project uh, you can go there and download it and have fun with your uh, privacy browser okay i would love to see what you say in the comments i know i'm gonna get lots of hate <laughs> that's it hope you enjoyed it i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye bye